It is tough not having anyone completely understand how it's affecting, you know, as much as obviously I feel their dad in on what's happening or, you know, even my parents, they still don't know exactly how it is. I became um, a single mum a month before Chloe was born. Going through a breakdown of the marriage and having a newborn baby, you know, I just want to lie in bed and cry. Trying to explain that to other people, I guess they still don't understand because they're not, not living my life sort of thing. I had no choice. I just got in. I had to do what I had to do. We were all concerned because Tammy was talking about withdrawing from the course. She only had a, about five or six units left to go, so she was past the halfway mark. Um, but because of how she was feeling in her home life, she rang in to withdraw. So I will let's have a chat with her, because I, I like to think that I see the value in people, and so I don't want to see them quit. I want to build her up, so I met up with Tammy at Churchill, and Tammy and I really connected. As soon as I saw her, I knew, oh cool, this is going to be an awesome opportunity to touch somebody's life and change it for the future. So in my observations with Tammy when I first met her was that uh, her self-esteem needed to be built up, because I could tell from her conversation that she's an intelligent woman, but she just had a few knockbacks. So what I focused on for the first few sessions was building her confidence and her self-esteem again so that it would be easy and not so stressful for her. She became really confident and started talking about progressing with her education. So her mindset changed and her language started to change and then I knew that she was really moving ahead and it was awesome to see. From my study patterns and the confidence that I had through Churchill education, I know what I need to do to be able to to continue studying on, on my own. To see how she's changed in her own personality and how she was lifted up, her spirit was lifted up and she was excited about options she now had for the rest of her life as a single mum. I felt really privileged that I had put into her life that's helped take her to the next step. It takes enormous courage to study because it puts up your hand and says I need to learn something more and I can be something more. I never look at just the student, I look at where they're going and how can we be a part of reaching out to those communities as well. When we got to the end and she said she was finished and she was going to university, I went, yes! <laughs> awesome, because that's what I could see in her and now she could see that in herself. I'm stronger than I think, that's sort of been my learning from my study process because I've achieved something that I didn't think that I could do, but I've done it.